Hello, good morning. We are uh, in Herdada do Freixo do Meia, Montada do Freixo do Meia, Montemoro, Novo Portugal. We are the case study 18 and we are focused on ancient varieties of leguminosas. We are trying first to uh, relearn how to um, uh, cultivate them and how to grow them. We lost that culture. That's a big challenge because for a long time we, we lose this tradition of using leguminosas and they are very very important for our agroecosystem of Montado in drylands because the rotations with the leguminosas plants are very important here. So the first part of the project is trying to, to re-establish this, this knowledge um, and to, to see what is the varieties more adapted uh, in rotations in this type of environment where we produce cork. The second part of the project is how to innovate with these products in terms of processing, in terms of creating new products. We are basi basically focused on the fava beam, on the lupinus and uh, on the chickpeas. So we are trying different products with these, these three different uh, leguminoses like a yogurt with, a, with a, a lupinus or um, we are also trying to produce snacks with lupinus or ham vegetable and ve vegetarian hamburgers or things like that. So uh, the first uh, part uh, we already done it a little bit. We, we started to, to different crops in different uh, moments of the year uh, trying to relearn how to use these plants and uh, so this is more or less uh, done and now we are in the, f in the second part where we are trying to, to innovate with these products. The challenges are very high, I say, I think the first one is the loss of the knowledge about the cultures but of course there is a very strong challenge related with climate change that created some problems on the first year of the project because Climate. We had always a very uh, uh, variability, big variability on the climate. But now with climate change, it's too much um, uh, more more intensive. So uh, we we have to adapt these cultures to this heterogeneity of the of the climate. 